Hey everybody, Scott Spritzer here, DocSports.com, and welcome to the update for Friday, June 7th, 2019. Got a free pick coming up in just a moment. First, a quick note before we get to the free pick. If you've yet to become a member over at DocSports.com and want to get a trial run, real cool way to do it, real cool date to do it. I'll tell you why in just a minute. But here's what you do. You click on the link below this video and you get yourself set up for a free $60 account. You can use those free 60 bucks on any of my daily packages or anybody else for that matter over at DocSports.com. Again, great way to give DocSports.com a trial run, $60 free account. And again, all you got to do to get started is click on the link below the video. Why did I say it's a great day to do it? Well, I've got a big seven unit play going in the NBA on Friday night. The clash between the Raptors and the Warriors up in the Bay Area. We cashed again the other night with the Toronto Raptors. Listen, here's what we've done in the NBA. As far as the finals, our current run, we are 44 and 24 going all the way back to the 2008 finals when the Celtics beat the Lakers 44 and 24 going into Friday. As far as this year, over the last couple of months, my current NBA run is 43 and 26. We've just been tearing it up. We're off to a winning start with the NBA Finals. And again, seven unit play, biggest one so far in the finals, goes on Friday night. It will be available Friday over at DocSports.com. Don't miss out. As far as everything else, UFC 238 goes on Saturday. I've got a seven unit play going in UFC 238. And that play, the our, our card for UFC 238 will be available to you on Friday, a day early, 8 p.m. Eastern, 5 p.m. Pacific. That's 8 p.m. Eastern, 5 p.m. Pacific. We will post our UFC 238 card topped off by that big seven unit play. And by the way, since I jumped on board at Docs last summer, we're up over $4,000 for those wagering just $100 per unit in the fight game. Don't miss out on that. That'll be available again on Friday evening for Saturday's UFC 238. Belmont will be available late Friday night, 11 p.m. Eastern. Our matchups for the Belmont on Saturday, four and two so far in this Triple Crown with our matchups. We won last year, first couple of the races. You don't want to miss out now on the final leg of the Triple Crown as we look to cash our matchups again. Those will be available late Friday night. Friday morning, WNBA, 11.30 a.m. Eastern is when our WNBA play for unit play will be available. Also, we're looking to go 2-0 in baseball on Friday. Those two plays also posted at that same time, 11.30 a.m. Eastern, 8.30 a.m. Pacific. Houston gets the job done yesterday. So again, a very busy weekend, and it starts on Friday with everything I just told you. Recapping real quickly, seven unit play in tonight's battle between the Raptors and the Warriors. We look to go to 45 and 24 on our current run. And again, seven unit play tops off USC 238. That pick available Friday night over at DocSports.com. And don't forget about baseball and WNBA on Friday. Friday. Unfortunately, last night we had to settle for a push in the WNBA. We had a nice sized play on Minnesota and uh, boy, they were up by, what was it, 12 or 13 going into the fourth quarter. Only scored nine points in the entire fourth quarter. Still managed to push and if you got it early enough, you got the victory by a point against the spread. Uh, but for the most part, we had to lay two, so they won by two and you get your money back. But again, that tough fourth quarter where they scored just nine points, yet still won the game outright, still pushed uh, for most of you who might have jumped on board. One in baseball last night, and of course we had the free pick winner here in the NHL with the St. Louis Blues plus $1.35. Let's jump right into our free pick for Friday. And a quick note, our NFL thumbnail sketches will return on Saturday. We'll be talking about the Green Bay Packers for the upcoming season. Free pick on Friday. We are going to play the under between the Mariners and the Angels. You got Gonzalez going up against Haney, couple of Southpaws. Listen, both of these offenses are terrible in this situation. Seattle on the road against lefties. They've been miserable. They've yet to win a game in uh, those road night games against lefties on uh, this season. And they're averaging uh, about three runs per game in all their games on the road against lefties so far in 2019. About three runs per game. On the flip side, the Angels aren't doing much better. Home night games against lefties. They've been miserable. Horrible record. It's like one and six or something like that. And you got the battle between these two pitchers, Gonzalez and Haney. Haney's off to a great start. His first two games, first 11 innings. How about 
18 strikeouts, only one walk. His whip is incredible, right around 073. And as far as Marco Gonzalez is concerned, listen, he stinks at home, but he's been outstanding on the road thus far. And he might have a little bit of motivation chip on his shoulder because his last time out, boy, the Angels just rocked him all over the place. I think he bounces back where he does his best work, which is on the road. So we're going to play Seattle and the Angels under the total of nine. And again, that'll be Gonzalez against Haney on Friday night. Again, under nine Seattle at the Angels. All right, that's going to do it for us on Friday. Uh, listen, if you like these videos, be sure to click on that thumbs up button and be sure to subscribe. I do appreciate those who have done so thus far. I'm Scott Spritzer from DocSports.com. Let's put Friday in the win column right back here Saturday, no later than 5 a.m. Eastern, 2 a.m. Pacific.